If you feel more comfortable alone than in social situations, you're far from alone. Shyness and social anxiety are symptoms that many people experience at some point in their lives, and they can make communicating with others difficult or downright impossible at times. Luckily, there are some immediate things you can do to begin breaking out of your shell and starting to enjoy social interactions with confidence. Continue watching to learn how to build your self-confidence and overcome shyness and social anxiety today. Let's get started. Number one, get enough sleep. When you don't get enough sleep, it can affect your confidence in more ways than you might think. In one study of college students, participants who were sleep deprived performed worse on a mental agility task than those who had a normal night's rest. Just one night of not sleeping enough was linked to impaired performance on tests requiring focus and concentration. Making it clear that even after just 24 hours without enough sleep, it's more difficult for us to concentrate at our best. When you're lacking confidence, miscommunication is far more likely since our ability to speak clearly can also be compromised by too little shut eye, as our speech tends to become slower when we haven't gotten enough sleep. And if you feel like you're already struggling with social anxiety, lack of sleep can make things worse. While there are some biological factors at play here, your body releases stress hormones while you sleep. Researchers have found that people with poor sleep habits tend to show greater signs of depression, anger, hostility, and confusion than those who regularly get seven or eight hours per night. Getting enough sleep doesn't just help improve confidence. It makes it easier for others to see how confident you really are. So before you try any other methods for building confidence, start by getting more shut eye. Number two, make eye contact. There's a reason eye contact is important. It shows that you're confident. In fact, research from the Barnard Center for Research on Women found that those who make genuine eye contact are rated more positively than those who don't. So remember, look people in the eyes during your next conversation or presentation, even if it feels uncomfortable, and watch how your confidence soars. Be present. When we're talking with someone, there are two ways we can be present. We can either be here and now focused on what they're saying or there but not here thinking about other things being present allows us to give others our full attention and show them that we care about what they're saying this not only makes us appear more confident but also creates an environment where others feel comfortable opening up and sharing their own thoughts number three get out of your comfort zone most shy people avoid social situations because they fear rejection but a few simple steps can boost your confidence enough that you're eager to dive right in. First, make it a point to say yes when you normally would say no. While you may be worried about making mistakes, keep in mind that we often learn from our missteps. Take advantage of them by challenging yourself out of your comfort zone as much as possible. Instead of saying no, tell yourself you'll do everything possible to make sure whatever is going well, even if it doesn't. Once you've taken that first step towards social interaction, even if things don't go perfectly at least, try not to back out. By pushing through those awkward moments, you'll get comfortable being uncomfortable. You'll soon see how little effort was actually required on your part. And with every step forward, you're building confidence for next time. Just remember, the only way to improve is to practice. If you enjoyed watching this video, please like, share, and subscribe.